Today's guest is Lindsay Butterfield. Here's our job talk with a registered professional planner. Welcome to the Job Talk podcast, where we talk with people who love their jobs. Our guests open up about their challenges, surprises, and secrets to success in their industries. Through conversation, we explore their careers, past work experiences, and the education that got them to where they are now. This is the shortened version from our in-depth conversation. Please visit thejobtalk.com to find the full episode. Why should somebody consider going into a career of being a city planner? Well, just because it's so dynamic. And, uh, you know, if you care about people and the places that people live, I think there's nothing you could do that really has more of an impact. And, and that's really what drew me to it is how can I shape the quality of life of the world around me? Can you take us through a day to day and what you're doing in your job? Yeah, well, the fun thing is that my day to day is different every day. Um, and, and mine's probably a little bit different too, because I'm a manager now. So I am a director, um, at the city of Edmonton. So it's a much more management focused job versus like doing and getting in up to your elbows, um, into the, the, the work. Um, but a lot of it, I would say is really just uh, collaborative work. Um, so I work with engineers, I work with folks in economic development. I work with the people who build things as well as plan things to make sure that the things we're planning are actually able to be built. Um, yeah, we work with all kinds of people. And so I would say one of the one of the key things about this job is just coordination. So you're constantly coordinating um, and and uh, that can be with clients external to your workplace or with the people that I work with every day. And what do you love about the, the position? What I love is that it is different every day. Um, I think planning is a really great job if you're someone who's a bit of a generalist because there's such a wide variety of different things you can look at. Gets into the design of our cities, um, parks and the environment, um, where buildings go in the design of them, um, how people move around the city. All of these things are really important, um, as well as how we listen to the people who live here and take their input into account as well. So um, it really just has such a, there's just such a broad array of things that you can be involved in at any given time. And I think that's the thing that's really exciting about it for me. What are some of the challenges that you experience and stresses in your day-to-day work? Well, there are many of those. Uh, I think that one of the biggest challenges with planning is there's no right answer and everyone has an opinion. Um, and so uh, I would say another big piece of the, the work that I do is sorting through all the different ideas and opinions and trying to strike a balance. What makes a successful city planner, do you think? Someone who can navigate the, uh, those, those various opinions and uh, perspectives. Um, and I think if you're able to balance those and... Um, A big part of balancing that so that people are satisfied is also educating. So talking about why are things the way that they are and being able to convey uh, so that they understand, like, why is it that my neighbor can plant that tree there? Um, Might seem just like not a big deal, but I can tell you that there is a lot of uh, discussion you get to have as a planner about things like that. And, And so it's just about being able to explain when you have rules, why are they there? And, uh, and then also to accept that sometimes we have rules and, and they don't make sense and, and being able to navigate how to adapt those. Are, what are the, some of the misconceptions about the position that you have as a city planner? Hmm. I think a lot of people just don't understand exactly what, when you say planner, it's a very kind of vague word. Um, and so when I say, oh yeah, I'm a, I'm a planner, uh, a lot of people think I plan events. Um, I've had a lot of people say, oh, you, you decide where the roads go, um, which (laughs) is interesting. Um, yeah. So I think there's just a lot of misunderstanding of what a city planner actually does. And, and that that's, that makes sense to me because there are such a wide variety of things that city planners do, but I would say like the foundation of what work we do is really determining, um, what can be built where. 
Thank you for tuning in to the Job Talk podcast. For more information, please visit us at thejobtalk.com.